What's up, Mainframe team? We're back. We told you you'd be seeing more of us. I'm Mick, founder and CEO. I'm Austin, head of marketing. And for those of you who've been following lately, you'll know that Mainframe has been giving away Mainframe tokens to a lot of different people in a lot of different ways. We're calling it our crowd gift. So we started phase one, proof of being. The last video, we talked a little bit about that, where physical tokens were dropping from the sky. We know you all love the airdrops, but we're not gonna stop there. Phase two, proof of freedom, it's happening now. So phase two is where we ask you one simple question. Why does Mainframe and its mission matter to you? And we were asking people to submit their answers in whatever medium they choose. And we thought we would see, I don't know, some pictures, some videos, some tweets, some blog posts, but we had no idea the variety and creativity that we've seen in the thousands of submissions so far. Yeah, you guys are pretty weird and wacky and wonderful. Thank you so much for the many submissions that we received. It is an honor to have such an amazing community behind what we're doing. Uh, it's gonna take us a while to sort through it all and to look at every single submission. But in the meantime, we wanted to share some of our early favorites it. with you today. Let's do it. So where should we start? Pictures? Pictures, let's talk about pictures. You guys submitted so- you start over, I was like looking at my watch. <laughs> <laughs> You're like talking to me. I like pictures. Pictures. Yes. We did get a lot of pictures. Memes. Watercolors. Graffiti. We line drawings. Chalk paintings. Vector drawings. We had all sorts of amazing pictures. We had one full manga comic. So we brought a few of our favorite pictures today and we wanted to show a little bit about them. My first choice is the Braveheart themed me. That's me with long hair. I've never seen myself with long hair before. And of course it line, aligns with our values of freedom. Mel Gibson, Braveheart. Freedom. I'm gonna interject here and say that a lot of submissions were playing to our ego by yeah. putting our faces <laughs> on things. It's true. Not a bad strategy, to be honest. It's not bad at all. I don't know where they got this picture, but I don't know, it's pretty good. It works. Yeah. It's believable. It works. Continuing the theme of putting our images into other people's pictures, this is uh, Moses, 10 Commandments. <laughs> Let my people free, let my people go. Again, freedom themed, a liberator here. They really like to stroke the ego, don't they? Yeah, they yeah. feel special. Thank you for putting my face on so many things. There were a lot of remixes. You guys really went nuts with remixing existing culture and working mainframe into that. That one was Do you have, a, you have the Star Wars one as well, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the next one, actually. Ta-da! <clears throat> so it's got uh, Eric Schmidt from Google up here. It's Darth Vader. Um, I like Luca as Princess Leia. Careful where you put your fingers there. <laughs> Matt on our team just appears to be a blue person, not a like blue an alien, alien. just the <laughs> blue plaid wearing person. So return of the MFT. So I thought this was just really simple, clean, geometric. I love the Chinese characters. There's something about Chinese characters that just makes it feel beautiful and you know, calligraphy. I think this is the type of thing that I would want to put in our office. We could. We could totally yeah. frame that. Really cool stuff. I really like this one. I want to frame this one and put it in our office. Wow. This, the person who submitted this said they were working on it for 21 hours. We have the multi-headed Hydra of surveillance and the mainframe hero smiting them down, smiting down the, the, the mighty Hydra. That's awesome. Did they put my face on that one as well? No, we're looking at the back of the heroes. Oh, hands. man. Sorry to mix <laughs> ego. His face isn't on each and every one of these. I really liked this painting. Kind of abstract, it's got the mainframe colors, the mainframe logo. We've got a picture of the guy who actually made it. So this is who submitted it. Shout out to this guy. Very cool painting. Okay, yeah. the next one is probably one of my top three favorites. Are you ready for this? A pregnant woman with baby socks and a paper with the painted mainframe logo. It's beautiful, it's artistic, black and white, except for the logo. This is another one that I wanna put either in our office or my wife's gynecology office. One or the other. How about this one? Still kids, I really like this one. Yep. Fine photography, again, black and white, again, color in the logo. Yep. And speaking of children or what children might like, we had a number of superhero type themed things. We had a lot of superhero. So I can't tell if this is Austin or if this is me. I don't know. What do you think by the color of the hair? This mainframe man. Totally. Anyway, a lot of cool superhero themed ones. We had Batman and Robin. We had obviously this one. 
think there were a few others, but. So we really dig these animated GIFs. GIF, GIF, I don't know, but these were amazing. One even outlined some of the key principles in our white paper, like encryption, dark routing, peer-to-peer -peer architecture, incentivization, interoperability. It was pretty amazing. What else did we have? We had music? Yeah, we had a lot of music. In fact, we had at least five different mainframe raps submitted. There was also a country song, an EDM song, some techno, an epic cinematic score, a song that sounds a whole lot like karaoke. We had videos, we had all kinds of videos, from testimonials to motion graphic to screen sharing to abstract and symbolic. It's not a true mainframe video if we don't talk about food. There were three mainframe cakes and they looked so delicious. There was a sand castle, a few crossword puzzles. There were at least three working video games submitted. You guys are blowing me away. Functional video games. There was a masquerade mask made. I mean, how topical, privacy, anonymity. We never would have thought of that. And there is so much of this stuff that we never would have come up with on our own. Did you like what you just saw? It was amazing. There were some really good submissions in, in all of the many submitted. And here's the thing, you guys. We hosted this contest, but you brought it to life. There's no way we could have come up with the thousands of things that you submitted. And I think the mainframe network is going to be exactly the same way. We have a small team, we're smart people, we could come up with some amazing applications, but the reality is there's no way we could come up with the thousands of different use cases for the communities that you all live in, right? It's gonna be some crypto finance genius who's gonna come up with the finance or accounting or arbitrage uh, distributed application that gets used widely in that industry or some physician in the medical industry who's coming up with some HIPAA compliant record sharing app. It's gonna be somebody in a community that we're not even aware of that comes up with a perfect use case for them and their colleagues and their friends and their family in a way that we never would have thought. What we know is that privacy and security is important and we're excited to see what you come up with. We wanna hear what you guys think in terms of these submissions, phase two submissions. What are some of your favorites? Hashtag mainframe for freedom on all the different social media websites. We would love your feedback as we're going through all of the submissions, judging them. We want to hear what you like. And what are you looking for in these videos? We really are big fans of videos. We want to keep coming at you with regular updates, but what do you want to see? Do you want to hear more from the team? Do you want to hear more about the technology? We're doing a lot of community building and this is awesome because we have an amazing community, but let's hear from you, the community. What are you looking for? Phase three is coming soon. You'll like what you see coming, stick with us. So thank you for being the most amazing community and uh, stick around, we are just getting started. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag mainframe for freedom. Hashtag Braveheart. Hashtag Batman. At Mick Hagen. <laughs> Peace. Need your information on lockdown. Everything you receive is in decentralized, secure and sound, digital communication.